Hi guys and girls, this is Claudia here from Metal Days 2017 with Employ this time. Thanks for being hey. here. So, have you seen anything of the festival site so far or you just arrived? Uh, we arrived yesterday, Okay. pretty late. We came from Linz, it's like five hours about, mm -hmm. so we were pretty tired after the drive. Mm -hmm. uh, we watched some bands, but not that much. We went okay. to sleep pretty early. Yeah. So you, what have you been watching? Like which shows have you seen? Uh, we catched uh, Blue Spills last night and and a bit of Opeth, and they were both uh, really good. And you enjoyed. Today we were watching now uh, Loath. They're mm -hmm. playing in the second stage. They finished right, right now. Right. I didn't know this band, and they were they're pretty cool. Yeah. Cool. So watch out for that. Yeah. <laughs> So uh, when you're getting on stage, when you're getting ready, like how are you going about that? Is there like you concentrate on your technical stuff or are you try to calm yourself down or pump yourself up? That's a good question <laughs> actually. Um, or you just well, go on the stage nah, and watch just, it? Yeah, <laughs> kind of. Um, now we're just sitting backstage and maybe sometimes jamming the guitar, but... Mm -hmm. So just for the it. fingers yeah. or yeah. warm up and yeah. that's it. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, you have that kind of energy on stage when you're playing live and then it comes to recording, uh -huh. like, how do you go about that? Um, yeah, we try to make the record sound uh, as much as possible as the live sound, mm -hmm. which is uh, very aggressive and, like you say, with a lot of energy. Nice. I don't know, we just... Uh, we, with the last album that we just uh, recorded, it's going to be out in September, uh, we worked really a lot on the sound, uh, on the studio, and I think it came out something like really with a lot of energy, and yeah, that's how we, we tried to put it then on stage with a lot of energy and passion. Yeah, so talking about the passion then. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, what do you think? Uh, defines an artist or a musician or who decides who an artist is Besides are you an artist um, <laughs> I would say yeah. yeah because I'm totally into music uh, this is my passion and I don't work besides so mm -hmm. this is everything I have and mm -hmm. I will do it in future so I'm looking forward to it mm -hmm. so it's about being all for the music and there's nothing else to it not really not really. I quit my job in uh, May, end mm -hmm. of May, and two weeks later, I'm pretty new in the band, just mm -hmm. by the way, and I, I, we went on tour two weeks after I quit the job, mm -hmm. and since then I'm in the band, yeah, so pretty new, I'm the baby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, referring to your question, uh, uh, for me, uh, about what, what makes a musician or an mm -hmm. artist, uh, since I was a kid I always thought that uh, the road is what makes a musician, you know, you can, you can learn a lot of, with your instrument and you can be really uh, technical with your instrument, but, but the road is what really makes you, you know, like a musician, you know, like living it every day, playing shows on a fucking Tuesday mm -hmm. and, you know, this is what makes a musician. That's, that's how I feel it. Mm -hmm. So what do you feel you share with your music? Like, is it like, you know, you get something out? like the aggression out or? Um, yeah kind of there's a there's a there's a lot of different ways to to express your feelings through the music and and there's a lot of different feelings you know there are bands who choose to express like positive feelings mm -hmm. through music you know and we don't really we don't really do that we we choose to to express uh, more of, of uh, our negative mm -hmm. feelings, you know, because I personally think the positive feelings, you should share them like every day and with everyone you have around, you know, right. and I don't want to share uh, negative feelings with the people I have around, you know, mm -hmm. so, so the band for us playing music like this, sharing these feelings through our music, it's kind of a, a way to uh, release mm -hmm all our demons in some way and yeah. and still uh, try to keep the positive feelings like for for the everyday life mm -hmm. 
And when it comes to decisions in your band, like, is that a democratic thing or do you split up? Okay, you're in charge of this, you're in charge of that, we won't interfere. Um, the thing is, there's only one original member in the band. Uh, I joined the band after a few months, it was uh, formed, and then the drummer joined uh, like last year. Mm. And he joined a few months ago, so the, the, this lineup right now is pretty new. Yeah. But um, we all choose, you know. We all have we all have Together. a vote, and we all have a voice in this band. We all have our say, you know. Mm -hmm. But for sure, there's some of us who work more on other stuff, like uh, Gabo, the vocalist. He works more in the booking mm -hmm. thing, and you know, more the the office part of the band, to say yeah. that way. And I don't know, the others we work more on, on the writing or stuff or we take care of merchandise. We just we pretty much split up the jobs but oh. but there's uh there's Gabo who mainly does uh most of the stuff. Mm -hmm. But we all choose. We are a democratic band. Right. So uh, we're gonna watch out for September then? September right? twenty two. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's great. So thank you very much for the interview. Thank you, thank thank you, you. guys.